Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently, we have a little bit of a mixed bag out here. You got the uh, semiconductor index, is the only index that's trading the upside. It's up 22.7 tenths percent. 29.41 is the print there. Otherwise, all the other U.S. indices trading the downside. Dow off uh, 230.7 tenths of percent. S&P 31.7 tenths as well. Three tenths for the NASDAQ 100. That's 43 points. The Russell off about three tenths as well. That's five points. Gold is down nearly uh, two and a half percent. 46 buckaroonies to the downside. Silver 50 cents. That's two and two tenths percent. So uh, light sweet crude off 19 pennies. 104.50 is the print there. Natural gas is up 19 cents. Trading at 7.43. And the 30-year treasury back one point and 1930 seconds. 139.03 is the print there let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart we begin by taking a look at the es mini what's the es mini doing it's testing it's february 27th swing point that level is 4092.75 the actual low that we have seen so far today is 4092.25 now in theory, if we get a close above 4092.75, we will have a test and rejection of a very key swing point, one that has some pretty significant volume. If we get a close below 4092.75, well, then that says that we have lower price coming at us. So just one number that you have to pay attention to, that's 4092.75 on the ES Mini. It's just tested that level. Um, now, if it's going to bottom, and during the Trader's Edge show, we'll go do a deep dive into the ES mini charts and the NQ charts as, as, and take a look and see if we can find any kind of short-term uh, intraday uh, bottoming uh, signals or anything along those lines. you got the spot volatility still well above its 50-day exponential moving average. So that is bearish, directly speaking, for the S&P. The NQ still is maintaining its by the D point. So it formed by the D point last Thursday when it created that three river morning star, very close to the completion of an A to B equals CD to the downside. And that's at the 12.80150 level. So as long as price closes above that in the NQ, and you're certainly going to want to watch that, then you've got a key bottom that will have held. U.S. dollar index has a TD9 count top. You've got a new profile that is formed. Price is consolidating within it. That's between 102.29 and 103.95. Gold right now is trading below the bottom of its weekly profile. Of course, it's the beginning beginning of the week. A close below that would be a, a very bearish thing. And uh, silver going to form a uh, going to complete a TD nine count bottom today. And it's doing it right at TD nine count breakout support, which is twenty two dollars and twenty cents. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z show. But if you're off to start your Monday, have a magnificent one. Thanks so much for joining us. And we'll see you again soon. The